Hi-ho, it's Silver with another happiness hack. When I saw this morning that the happiness hack was only take inspired action, I thought, wow, the universe really <laughs> has my number because I was not in the mood to do this video. I wasn't in a mood to do anything. In fact, this is what I look like. I can't believe I have to do anything today. I'm feeling sorry for myself. Um, I was picking fights with my husband, Reggie. I was full of self-pity. And so um, it was it was a problem. So I have this tool that I use, because I thought I can't record a video that's gonna be hypocritical. So I have this tool that I use that I've talked about before, but it bears repeating. It's called HALT, H-A-L-T. So I asked myself, are you hungry? Are you angry? Are you lonely? Are you tired? And you know what? I was angry. And I can trace it back that Two nights ago, I was up past midnight, which, believe me, is a lot for me, <laughs> because we had a water break in our house, and I had to be, um, what do you call it, um, when you're getting water, out, bailing water out of my bathroom, and uh, it was exhausting. I mean, not just the bailing, but dumping the water was really exhausting, and so, and then the next day, I was too tired to function. I was going to record the video the next day, and I was just like a zombie. So today I'm I'm woke up and I'm like I'm a day behind. <laughs> I can't believe this is happening to me. Um, so I needed to do something. I needed to you know fix the problem because I can't record a video about this without it. So what did I do? First of all, the first thing I did was I I apologized to poor Reggie because he had come to apologize to me after I after I was mean to him, and uh, I said look. It's not you. I'm in a really bad mood because, you know, I feel like I'm behind. And you just got in my way. It had nothing to do with you. And then number two, the other thing that I did while I was doing my makeup for the shoot <laughs> is that I listened to music that I really like. And, uh, boy, I was belting it out, too. I was, I was singing Whitney Houston. And I could lie to you and tell, tell you that it was really good, but it was terrible. But it made me feel really happy to just be singing and letting it out. And so what I did and what I'm encouraging you to do is if you are in a mood where you really don't feel like doing anything, you've got to take some action to get inspired because anytime you take action that is not inspired, then it's not going to turn out well. Remember, you attract more of what you focus on. And so if you're focused on, like I was this morning, uh, being a you know self-pitying little brat, I got to tell you, it was so bad. <laughs> I finished my cereal, this one, the box of cereal this morning. And we're supposed to flatten the boxes before we put them in the recycle. I was mad that I had to flatten the box. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to do this. Let somebody else flatten this box. I was just, it was just ridiculous. And so um, I was angry and I started to take care of that. And let me tell you why um, it's important to, uh, you know, take an only inspired action. I have this beautiful card. I know you can't read it like that, but I just wanted to show it to you. It's just kind of cool. Um, and it says, my productivity stems from inspiration. When I focus on what brings me joy, my tasks become effortless actions. And you know what? This has become an effortless action for me today because I took the time to line up my energy so that I was inspired to do this. Um, so if, like me, you have those days where you just get into a really bad mood, uh, what I want to do is tell you that it is it is possible to cross the finish line. Uh, I am you are witnessing me cross the finish line right now as I record this video, and that's me. Woohoo! I did it. <laughs> so this week's hack is only take inspired action. Um, I'm still learning how to do that. And uh, remember, you deserve to be happy, and it is possible. So get out there and get inspired. Bye for now.